Mary presented for an acute episode of required care for her diabetes complications. She was first screened for her age, found to be 75, that made her eligible for the Seniors ED. The Seniors ED started with focus on how do you maximize the family's contribution? So what's important to you as a family member? So we craft the whole plan of care around how we're advised. We committed to changing practice. As we attempted to render services to Mary, all she kept saying to us is, I have to go home, I have to go home. In the process of intake, we queried where Mary was in her life phase. That story revealed that Mary was the primary caregiver of her husband who had Alzheimer's and who was home alone. No one was changing Mary's mind, but she was leaving because to her, no matter what, getting home to her husband was the priority. To care for Mary is to care for something larger. And we truly believed that in order to treat Mary, we had to treat her husband, even if it were to just admit him along with Mary until we could figure out the next step. And while he was there with us, we evaluated his Alzheimer's, we treated Mary, we admitted her too. The role of the family in follow-up care or transitional care or inclusion in service provision, that's such an important part of what we do and, and where we learn that the absence of family or someone there to work with us really uh, made us up our game. Our geriatric nurse practitioner began to make phone calls. It took a lot of digging to unearth that Mary had a remote niece. Even though she couldn't come, she did, in her mind, still want to be part of what we were doing. We make that easy. We'll show you exactly what your next steps need to be. We'll hold your hand. We were able to discharge Mary stable with a follow-up appointment with our primary care physician, and we were able to arrange for in-home services ongoing uh, for her husband. But the best part of the story was we kept track of both Mary and her husband for weeks. It was almost as if we became the conduit of engagement. Hi, it's Holy Cross. Hi, we're just calling to let you know. Hi, do you have any questions for us? One person answers the calls, one person knows what's happening, and one person um, interfaces with the family with the sincerity, authenticity, genuineness that we really feel about our responsibility to care for seniors. My name is Judith Rogers, and I believe to be an expert in the care of seniors is to partner with families in the care of their loved ones.